Okay, let's see how multiplying a number out and factoring are very similar. So if I say 3 is multiplied by both 2a and 7, okay, then that means 3 gets multiplied by 2a and 3 gets multiplied by 7. So when I actually do that, let's write 3 in red twice. So 3 is multiplied by 2a and 3 is multiplied by 7. Okay. Then finally you would simplify it to say 6a plus 21. So that is multiplying out brackets. Okay. Now what I'm looking at is the opposite, going from here to here. And we call that factoring. Okay. So what I'm going to look at first of all is let us take uh, 6a plus 21 and see what happens if they asked us to factor that. My first step is I'm going to write uh, 6a as 3 times 2a and 21 as 3 times 7. Okay, so I break it up into its prime factors. Now what you can see is that 3 belongs here and 3 belongs there. We call that a common factor. And what I'm going to do then is write 3 out in front of brackets. Like that. And we now have our answer. So whatever I have done more than once, I only have to do once. Everything else, the things that aren't underlined, go in the bracket. Okay, so let's just remind ourselves, whatever is done more than once, you only have to do once. Okay, everything else goes in the brackets. And I will be referring to this uh, little phrase very, very often in this common factoring, uh, this whole factoring session. So there is the main idea of taking out a common factor.